The cabinet appointed subcommittee led by Justice Minister Dr. Vijay Das Rajpaksha completed the drafting of the legislation establishing a broadcast authority for the creation of a broadcasting regulatory commission. This document contains multiple sections on electronic media that need to be taken seriously. It proposes for the establishment of a broadcasting regulatory commission comprising five members. The secretary to the Ministry of Media and the Director General of Telecommunication will serve as the ex officio members. The other three members will be appointed to the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission by the President. According to this document, the scope of the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission covers serious areas concerning the process of electronic media. The objective of the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission shall be to ensure to carry on the broadcasting services without any detriment to national security, national economy and public order. In addition, the objective of the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission is also to ensure that broadcasting services shall provide people true and accurate information as guaranteed by the Constitution. Further, the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission shall issue annual licenses for broadcasting services. In addition, another objective of the Broadcasting Broadcasting Regulatory Commission is to issue guidelines in respect of broadcasting to enhance the spiritual development and mental health of the people while safeguarding the social and cultural values and entertainment of the people. The Broadcasting Regulatory Commission will also be empowered to formulate codes of conduct to be followed by the broadcasting entities or persons in consultation with the licensed broadcasters. The new legal framework proposed by the Cabinet-appointed subcommittee led by Dr. Rajapaksha proposes to appoint an investigation committee to investigate complaints and make recommendations. The three-member committee shall be headed by the Director-General of the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission and the other two members will be those with experience in the field of law or mass media. This committee may conduct an investigation upon its own initiative or upon the request by an interested person on any matter in which a license holder of any broadcasting service is involved in what may lead to a threat to national security, national economy or may create any conflict among races and religions. A serious section in this document is that for the purpose of an investigation, the committee may, by notice in writing, require any person or entity to produce to the committee any specified document, specified written or oral information which the committee considers relates to any matter relevant to the investigations. It proposes that the committee shall have the power to enter, inspect and search the premises where the broadcasting service is being carried out with any entry warrant issued by a magistrate and take copies of or seize and detain any relevant records or document of such broadcasting entity. Upon the recommendations of the committee, the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission may cancel, suspend or impose a fine to the license issued to the broadcasting entity. In addition to the violation of any clause of the Broadcasting Regulatory Commission Act, the Commission can also take a decision on the license issued to a broadcasting entity if it had broadcasted anything that may create a threat to national security, economy or conflict among races or religions. It notes that any person who fails to comply with any direction or recommendation issued by the Commission or refuses to cooperate shall be guilty of an offence and shall be convicted after a summary trial before a magistrate is held and could also be liable to a fine or imprisonment or both. Any person or entity that engaged in broadcasting services aggrieved by a decision of the Commission may appeal against such a decision at the Court of Appeal. What is most interesting in this document is that it does not give a definition to the terms of broadcasting, broadcasting service provider, license and licensee.